Hi there, how are you? Right now I will explain to you how to solve one type of monopoly question, right? Given machine cost equal to 40 and the demand curve, you need to determine machine revenue function, the output and the price under monopoly, the output under competition, and the death weight loss from monopoly production right so first you need to graph monopoly market from given information so machine cost equal to 40 and the demand curve like this all right so let's go to our first question determine machine revenue function so to get that you need to define revenue function so revenue is just a function of quantity that represents the relationship between how much money the company earns for a given quantity of product sold. And it calculated by multiplying the price and the quantity. So you keep the quantity and need to transfer price in quantity by using the demand curve. So you have Q equal to 200 minus 2P or P equal to 100 minus 0.5Q. So you just replace this into this equation to get revenue equal to 100 minus 0.5Q times Q or revenue equal to 100 Q minus 0 0.5 Q square. So this is revenue function. So from this function, you can easily get machine revenue function. So machine revenue is also a function of quantity, but it represents an additional revenue you would gain by selling an additional unit of quantity, or is equal to a change in revenue over a change in quantity. And this is just the derivative of revenue function. Right, so you need to differentiate revenue in order to get marginal revenue. So marginal revenue equal to the derivative of revenue and equal to 100 minus 0 0.5 times 2 times Q on the power 2 minus 1. Or marginal revenue equal to 100 minus Q. So you get marginal revenue function. And you can easily fill it in this graph. And you could notice that marginal revenue is always under demand curve. All right. And marginal revenue lies is always intersect the bottom line at the midpoint. So the bottom line here, you see, is from 0 to 200, and the midpoint is 100. So marginal revenue, uh, we meet the bottom line at the midpoint, all right? And under the demand curve. So that is a special relationship between marginal revenue and the demand curve, all right? So let's move to our next question to determine the the output and the price under monopoly. So under monopoly, firm always try to maximize its profit by producing at an output we call QM at which is marginal revenue equal to marginal cost, right? So, marginal revenue here is 100 minus Q. 
equal to machine cost here is 40. Then you get QM equal 60. So this is the output under monopoly. So how to solve this in this graph? This will be from the intersection between machinal revenue and machinal cost and you get 60 or the QM. Alright. So to get the monopoly price, so just replace this value into the demand curve. So demand curve is Q equal 200 minus 2P or P equal to 100 minus 05Q, right? Or PM equal to 100 minus 05 times 60. Or PM equal to 70. All right, so this is a price under monopoly. So how to solve this in graph? You just line up from the intersection point up to the demand curve and correspond with that. This will be monopoly price 70 and this monopoly price. All right. And this intersection point called monopoly equilibrium. All right. So let's move to our next question to determine the output under competition. So under competition, firm when set up the price we call PC equal to machine cost and equal to 40. So this will be here in the graph. Right, PC equal to 40. And to determine the output under competition, you just replace this value into the demand curve. Right, so Q equal to 200 minus 2P or QC equal to 200 minus 2 times 40 or QC equal to 120. So this is the, the output under competition. So how to show in this graph is when be from this intersection point correspond to this point is 120 and this is QC. Alright, the output under competition and this intersection point we call EC is equilibrium under competition all right so let's move to our final question to determine the death weight loss from monopoly production all right so it is measured by this area we call this point is a so death weight loss is measured by the error a EM, EC, and this is just the social welfare, welfare loss because of the decrease in the output and the increase in the price under monopoly. So this equal to half QM minus QC times PM minus PC. Alright, so this is just the fall in consumption and this is the, the increase in the price because of monopoly behavior. Alright, so just replace the value into this equation then you get this is 60 minus 120 and this 70 minus 40 then you get the death weight loss equal to minus 900 all right so this is the, the death weight loss from monopoly production all right so i just finished showing you how to show 
one type of monopoly question. I hope that my explanation is useful for you and good luck.